Okay, thank you for that. So it will just be a normal stand up uh, just uh, give us what you've been doing what you did yesterday what's your plan now uh, for the week any blockers that you have and uh, just before we start i see there's a volunteer you did here thanks for volunteering announcement i think any big uh, announcement at the moment is just that our hot seat for today is um is faith i don't know if he's uh, here already but uh, maybe he'll be joining us and also we have uh, one tutorial today in the afternoon make sure you don't miss that okay straight into the stand up any other announcements okay thank you everest for that if any other announcement comes i think we'll just do that uh, before the hot seat okay didia you can start us uh, with uh, what you've been doing didia over to you so to give an update of what I've been doing, I've been working on this week's challenge. And uh, yesterday, I've completed the test that was given to us, the challenge test. And I've started the implementation of this week's challenge. Uh, I don't think it will be hard because it's somehow similar to what we have been doing on last week. We just have to change some operators that we are going to use. And uh, I haven't worked well on the visualization part last week, so I plan to work more on the visualization part for this week and for today. I plan to work uh, on the interim submissions, the report in my GitHub, and submit that on the no blocker so far. Okay, thank you for that, Yudidia. I'm just wondering, maybe do you have feedback for the test that you did yesterday? How was it? Uh, the test was good. Uh, it was good, I think. Uh, but somehow the the non technical part was a bit long and uh, it needed some somehow uh, compared to the technical part it needed some focus but it was good. Okay, thank you for that. So Martin, you can go next, and uh, if you've also done the test already, you can just give us your feedback as well on that test, Martin. Martin, Martin, can you hear me? You're muted. Martin. Okay. Hello. Yes, hello, Martin. I can hear oh, you now. Uh, yeah, sorry. Uh, sorry for that. Uh, I think I I was having some issue with my connection. Yeah. So uh, yesterday and today, I think I've just uh, yesterday I was doing the the particular test uh, and uh, it was able to go on well. It was just, uh, I think it was more of the non-technical than the technical, but uh, it was good. Uh, so I began working with a particular, for this particular task, uh, that was yesterday, setting up the Apache SuperNet, doing the configurations and also uh, migrating the data. Yeah, so uh, I've been able to work on that. Now I just want to work on the reports so that uh, we can be able to uh, do the interim and also the final reports. Yeah, thank you. Okay, thank you for that, Martin. I assume there's no blockers because you have not mentioned uh, any. Is that right? There's no blocker at the moment. Uh, yeah, right now there is, yeah, there's no blocker. I think the task is, is good. Okay, over to Daisy. Um, thank you, Anastasia. Good morning. Uh, for my progress, yesterday I wasn't able to do much, but today morning I was able to uh, do the test. And my feedback um, about it was like, it was okay. I wasn't expecting the bit about the JavaScript code, so I fumbled for a minute. Um, but then again, also, I realized you would need to have like a good laptop because my laptop came, kept hanging from time to time. So that also means that time um, kept rolling by. So uh, that's just something to think about in future. Um, uh, so I was also able to just wind up on last week's project. So just touch it up. But so when I start out this week's project, everything um, is quite seamless. So my strategy, my rather my plan for today is just to um, work on today's interim submissions thank you 
Okay, that's uh, good to hear, Daisy. I hope uh, that the project uh, proceeds well, especially after you start uh, the migration. And if you get any blockers on the way, just uh, communicate with the team. Over to you, Stella. Okay, good morning. I hope that you can hear me. Yes, I can hear you clearly. Okay, so yesterday I was also winding up last week's project. Um, I have not quite completed, but I'm hopeful that I'll finish today and start working on today's um, to this week's project. I will also set up the environment for uh, this week's project. Um, I also did the test yesterday, which was quite um, okay. I think I was just, I have never done such a test, so it was quite challenging, quite um, fast paced, but. I'm glad that I managed it and I'm looking forward for more uh, to more practice on the gorilla test. Yeah. Okay, that is uh, nice to hear, Stella. It's good that you've now gotten us uh, an idea of what such tests look like uh, in preparation for what's come, what comes after, after next week. Okay, over to you, Donate. Hi, good morning everyone. So morning, yesterday yeah. yesterday I wasn't able to do much, but uh, I was able to go through some references and start my report for today's submission. Uh, I also took the gorilla test. It was uh, interesting, but uh, my connection was not that well, doing well yesterday. So yeah, that's my update. Okay, how about maybe a plan for this week's challenge that you plan to do? Um, for this week's challenge, today I'm going to start working on the interim reports and interim submission. Um, yeah, that's my plan for today. Okay, okay. I hear you have a plan for today. Also, make sure you have maybe a plan that's going forward to the week in terms of uh, migration. And so that you don't delay as well for the Saturday Saturday submission. Okay. Uh, so, okay. Okay. So I just I was just planning for today's submission. That's it. Wait. It's okay. It's okay. I was just uh, giving you that you should think about uh, the rest of the week. Okay. Uh, so I don't see any other hand up. Daisy, I don't know if it's still something else you want to say. I don't know if there's another volunteer. Yes, Shaka. Good morning, Anastasia and everyone. Good morning. So, yeah, yesterday I, I was trying to work on the rest part of week 11, week 11 challenge, which is the reader's part. And uh, uh, I made some progress. And uh, today I'm planning to, to start implementing week 12 project. And also yesterday I did like test go data test and it was like challenging, fast paced, yeah, but I experienced something. Okay, that is good to hear Shaka. Uh, just we'll go next over to you. That's Birok. Yeah, Birok. Uh, hello, good morning. I uh, hope you can hear me. Yes, I can hear you, but your sound is uh, low, but I can without some words. Maybe if you could try getting closer to the mic, but I can hear you. Okay, okay, I'll try that. Um, so yesterday, um, I was trying to go through different re uh, references in order to um, work on, the, on, on this week's challenge. So uh, other than that, uh, I also took the Gorilla test. It's uh, somehow um, quite challenging, especially from the time perspective. Um, anyways, I just uh, try to manage everything um, and I, I completed uh, the exam. Um, that was a, a good experience anyways, and uh, I am hopeful that we will have another um, experiencing our opportunity again 
so that, so that we can we can be more familiar with it you know it's a bit um new especially it's, I, I don't i don't uh, understand the way that, that the timing and that, that costs me some uh, some some uh, loses and uh, that was good anyways i really uh, want to acknowledge uh, your efforts here and um, uh, starting from today and uh, I'm, I'm planning to work on the weekly challenge and, and also the, the submission report the interim submission report yeah that's that's all i have thank you Okay, thank you, Birok, for that as well. I'm actually glad to hear that you guys are experiencing some um, challenges with this test. It's good to actually have the experience so that when you get now a real job, you can actually know how to manage your time when attempting this type of test. So just moving forward to test five. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, yes, I can hear you. Okay. Uh, so uh, yesterday I uh, go through the challenge and uh, write some uh, interim report for the uh, this week's challenge, and also have planned out everything that I needed to finish. Uh, so uh, today I'm planning on beginning the coding part. Um, I don't think it's uh, too hard to. Do, but I'm not planning on doing uh, this challenge project extensively because I want to focus on uh, those uh, four projects that I'm going to present next week. So, uh, yeah, I was also going through those uh, projects that I have done before and trying to choose which one, uh, which ones I am going to present. And I think the others are okay, but I don't. Uh, I'm not sure which one to present as a data engineering project. Uh, other than that, I also took the test, and uh, uh, it says 54 minutes, but it feels like uh, a little bit uh, more than that, you know, as, uh, especially the non-technical tests. Uh, seems a little too long, but I guess it's just uh, 54 minutes, so yeah, that's is by my side. And today I'm planning on uh, uh, writing some codes on GitHub, and yeah, I, I have finished the interim report already. Okay. Okay, thank you, which is fine. So maybe just one thing I noticed you mentioned is uh, you're not concentrating a lot on this week's project. And I'd like to know which track you chose. Was it the data engineering track or the machine learning track? Machine, machine learning track. Oh, okay, okay. So if you get extra time towards after the, after, after the program and uh, maybe you get some interest in data engineering, you could again go back to this project and use it to further your, um, your skill. But don't just say I don't want this project because I'm in machine learning. I think uh, Ibebal or someone did mention that sometimes you just focus on machine learning, then you get to job. And you find that you actually you'll you'll have shifted to another track. So don't don't choose depending on the track you've just chosen. Just focus and do all the projects that have been given. Okay. Next, uh, Hewan. Okay. Hewan, I see. Okay, just fine. Hewan, I see you've given us your updates on the charts. Thank you for that. Then next, you we'll just go to titles. Oh okay, okay. Uh, uh, good morning. Are you able to to hear me? Yes, yes, I can hear you, Titus. Okay. So, uh, from my side, also yesterday, I was just trying to finalize on my last week's uh, project. I made some consultation with regard to the blockers that I was facing, and uh, I made a good a uh, good progress. So, um, but, but I didn't like complete it. So um, today I'm working towards uh, completing it before the evening so that I do the, the interim submission. Because yeah, I have to move fast because of the, today, the interim submission that's due today. So basically, yeah, and about the, the gorilla test, yeah, yesterday I took the, the test. And as I'll join everyone in saying that uh, it was quite challenging, especially with the time. 
so yeah i need to do more on that and also uh, better manage my time with regards to the tests so that's my progress for, for the day so yeah thank you okay thank you thank you as well so again without a mention of blocker are we assuming that there is no blocker you're facing And no, 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 I'm good. I'm good right now. But yeah, if I do face, I, I'll consult with my peers just as I did yesterday. Okay, okay, thank you. Thank you. So, yes, Rafa, you can go ahead and give us your update on the messages. And as you do that, we'll go next to Tadis. Mr. Desi, Mr. Desi, can you hear me? Hello, good morning. Can morning. you hear me? I can hear you. Okay, from my end, uh, I am just uh, <clears throat> doing on, on understanding this week challenge for, and uh, I have taken the exam by yesterday, and uh, it was good. Uh, and even what I am, what I understand from taking such types of exam is uh, for the future time, if we will, <clears throat> we will compete for the job. Uh, we should have to know at least uh, the basic knowledge of the language, programming language, just like uh, JavaScript, uh, Python, uh, SQL, and so on things. So, uh, what I feel is uh, I, I have to. I have to upgrade my knowledge uh, regarding that programming language uh, by reading uh, the tutorials, the resources. So that is uh, the thing I have planned after having the exam because uh, the exam will be given in a short time and as I will evaluate you. And even though we know the data engineering machine learning tasks, that may let us to fail to get into the job. So uh, that is my plan to prepare myself. And uh, from the week challenge, this week challenge side, just uh, I'm leading uh, how how we will how we migrate the data that we have used in one type of data and another tool of data type. Uh, I mean data base types and. Uh, how do we migrate to the other? I'm reading that one. So I have tried the previous one using my scale. So I need to now move it to Postgres or so Postgres scale and so on things. So I have planned to do so. And then for today's uh, submission, uh, after uh, starting from afternoon, I will prepare the report and uh, try to submit in the and that you and uh, and uh, on the deadline so yes those are uh, my updates from my end so thank you okay thank you for that update Tadese. so just uh, to answer rafa and hoping that someone else will uh, volunteer to go next uh the tutorial today is not on data migration, but it's on uh, the Apache SuperNet. The data migration tutorial will come uh, later this week on Friday, Friday afternoon. We are actually following a, a, an alumni and their team, so we'll have that for Friday afternoon. So there's no one else who's volunteering, so I guess uh, nice is Teodros. Uh, good morning, Anastasia, and good morning, everyone. Good morning. Uh, so yesterday, uh, I was uh, exploring references for this week's challenge uh, and also exploring the challenge document. Uh, and I also took the Gorilla test, uh, and I really found it, uh, it's a, it was a good experience to actually work uh, within a very short time. So I think it, it was a good experience for me. So today my plan is going to be to finalize the interim submission and uh, after that proceed with the implementation. So no blockers so far. Okay, thank you for that update to Wondros. Moving on to Ken. Hey, good morning, can you hear me? Good morning, I can hear you well. 
So <clears throat> yesterday, I'll begin with the update, update for yesterday. Yesterday, I was working on last week's challenge. There are a few points I had, a few tasks I, net, I had not finished up, the DBT part and the dash part. So I was finishing up on the code a little bit. Then I also took the test. It was quite a wonderful experience, a challenging one, of course, because the time was moving really fast. But it was a nice experience. I need to work on my JavaScript programming skills. And then I think I'll be, I'll be ready for the job market. For today, I think I'll go through references for this week's project. I haven't done much on it yet. I was still focusing on finishing on last week's project. So there are no blockers on my end so far. Thank you. Okay, okay, thank you for that. Uh, Ken, I do understand that most of you are saying you're finishing last week's project, and I think uh, that's actually recommendable because commendable because uh, both of last week's and this week's project are actually connected. And before you just shift migration and uh, doing this and that, it's actually good to ensure that it actually works in uh, one environment. So it's actually commendable to hear that uh, most of you are focusing on finishing last week's project. Okay, so Matilda, I see your update uh, from the from the chats. I'll just go ahead and read it while waiting for another volunteer. So Matilda, Matilda says, Matilda says that okay, working on last week's challenge as well, and uh, so far good progress. Mm. Sorry. Test, uh, you did the test gorilla and it was a good exposure. A few issues with the network, but it's okay. Okay, thank you, Matilda, for that. I think I don't know, Ken, if that's an addition or you you dropped your hand and you raised it again before we continue to Henok. Ken, do you have something to add on? Okay, I'll take silence as a no. So Henok. Yes, Ken. It was raised by Mr. Premila. Ah, okay. Okay, okay. Henok, Henok, over to you. Uh, okay, okay. Thank you. Uh, good morning, Anastasia. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Uh, so, let me start with Monday. I, I just uh, tried to f clean up some some of the visualizations I did with Stradash by talking with a DA. Uh, that was what I was doing on Monday. And yesterday, uh, I didn't have, like, a stable internet, so I wasn't able to be productive. But I uh, took the test on that on Gorilla test, and when I got disconnected, I was trying to check uh, my internet. So when I, when I left the full screen mode for some reason, it deleted all my code, and I didn't have time to rewrite the code and submit the coding part. But other than that, the rest was okay. And that taught me that I shouldn't start the test unless I have uh, like a good enough internet. And for today, I'm uh, preparing my submission, and I'm hopeful that I will submit on time. And yeah, then there are no block blockers so far. Okay, thank you for that update, and sorry to hear about other uh, issues you faced yesterday. So maybe I'm just, uh, I'd like to know, were you, so after the error that you had with the with the code, were you able to do it again or uh, now you are not able to submit any code? Uh, I, I, like, I wasn't able to submit the, the coding part. I'm not really sure if it's submitted or not. It, it didn't show me the result. Okay, thank you just for that update. Maybe I'll follow up and see if uh, anything can be done, but uh, okay, just thank you for that. Sorry yeah. to hear that again. Okay, so do we have any other volunteers for this stand-up? Do we have any other volunteers? Should I just start calling out names if you have not spoken? 
Okay, randomly to Rahmat. Rahmat. Okay, Nados. Nados, can you hear me? Do you have any issues with your mic? Will you give us your updates on the text? Sure, sure. Nados, Rahmet, I will as well say something. I'm not sure if you can hear us. You can just use the chat box to communicate. Next, I uh, will go randomly to, to Salem. Salam. Okay. Okay. Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, we'll uh, talk to you on my progress. Uh, I was uh, trying to set up the super set and uh, post dress this week. Uh, since I did, I did, I worked on, on a scale last week. I was working. Uh, I was trying to set uh, the new environments and do some things with them and also cleaning up what I did last week. Um, besides that, I've taken the gorilla, the this gorilla, and uh, it was quite challenging because of the speed. It was fast, and uh, I have to rush through my answers uh, to some of them, uh, but besides that, it was a good experience. Thanks, that's on my side. Okay, thank you, thank you. Salam for that update. Then you can just go to DA. DA. Okay, good morning, Anastasia. Good morning, everyone. Can you good morning. Me? Yes, I can hear you. So, yesterday um, I added my SQL to my Docker environment. Uh, since I did uh, last week's challenge using Postgres, I'm migrating my Postgres DB to SQL and uh, I've started working on that. Uh, and today I'll keep on working on the session and uh, write my report on that panel and be able to meet the deadline. Uh, regarding the this gorilla, uh, it was good. It was a, a very good experience. Uh, on one of the exams, uh, I ran out of time. And then the coding challenge, uh, uh, I wrote the code. And uh, 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 when I ran it, it was giving me errors. Uh, but I didn't know uh, until uh, the, it was, the test was over that I was using the colon instead of uh, uh, curly braces. So I thought I was uh, writing a Python script. Uh, so I missed on that. So it was a good experience. Yeah. And thank you. OK, thank you for that day. Again, sorry to hear that small hitch. I, it happens, and uh, it's good you have learned uh, from that. So next, we'll just go to Samuel, Samuel Aline. Hello. Hello, yes, yes, everyone. Okay. okay. Hello, good morning, to everyone. To give you an update from my side, uh, I haven't done much. I was up to with some personal issues yesterday, uh, but uh, I'm looking forward to doing the intern submission and next uh, migration part, as well as the test. Uh, I did the test on Monday, so. Uh, the JavaScript part was a little bit, uh, but as I went from that, it was all good. And I'm looking forward to enter the for today's deadline. Is that it for me? Okay, thank you for that, Samuel. Sorry that you're going through uh, personal issues. Sorry to hear that. So next, we'll just go to um, Faith, Faith Bagheera. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, yes, I can hear you. Yeah, um, so uh, this week I'll be uh, working on um, a different project uh, from uh, week 12. Um, uh, basically, uh, week 13. Uh, so yesterday I went uh, through it because um, I had uh, uh, forgotten uh, what 
we were supposed to do. So uh, it was a, a recap before um, I start uh, breathing um, where I stopped uh, from um, uh, interim submission and uh, uh, data visualization. And uh, uh, also I was able to do uh, the test at uh, Gorilla Test. Um, as everyone said, it was uh, challenging, uh, especially for uh, uh, the JavaScript uh, part. But I I was about to finish and uh, submit uh, by answering uh, most of the questions. Okay, thank you for that, Faith. I also hope that you are ready for the hot seat. She didn't mention anything about that, but uh, I do hope that you are ready for the hot seat. It's uh, it's not optional, so you must be ready. <laughs> okay, so next we'll just go to Melako. Melako, Melako, can you hear me? Okay, as Melako responds, let's go to Meron. Okay, good morning, everyone. Good morning. Mm -hmm. Yes, I can. Okay, so uh, I have uh, just updated you on my progress. I've been uh, trying to catch up fast on this week challenge because I was a bit lacking on the last week project. And hopefully I'll be able to make today's interim submission. Uh, I'm just trying to, I've been trying to understand uh, how we will be trying to migrate uh, last week's work. And as for the test gorilla yesterday we took, it was a bit challenging. Uh, it's, it was really fast paced and all. And we I had to answer all my questions very quickly. But I think it, it will get better with practice as we do it uh, for the second time or third time. Other than that, everything is good. Thank you. Okay, thank you for that uh, update, Meron. Uh, so I see Melako, you've uh, typed your your update on the chats, and uh, for both you and Ados, I haven't seen any. What? Where are you on the test, Gorilla? On the gorilla test that you did, that was supposed to be done yesterday. So maybe Nados and Melako, you can respond to that as we get an update from uh, Nahom. Okay, so Nahum. good morning. Good morning, Nahom. Well, yesterday, uh, I worked on setting up supersets uh, using Docker. And I also took the assessment on Test Gorilla. It was all right, but yeah, I didn't finish two of the tests in time, but it was good overall. Any blockers so far planned for the week? No, no blockers so far. Okay, thank you for that update, Nahom. So Milako and Ados, I'm still waiting to hear what you did on the test. Maybe if you have not been able to attempt, you can also say and what you when you plan to attempt it. And I'm also concerned that uh, Rahmet is here and uh, you're the only one who has not spoken. I don't know what's up. Could you type anything? Rahmet, you're the only one who has not said anything. Even if there's no update, just confirm that you're there then. So up to that, I guess we're done with the stand-up. Anyone with any additional additional uh, updates or anything additional to the team, you can uh, take uh, the floor now. Also, if there are any announcements from the team, from the Tin Academy team, you can also do them now. As uh, we prepare for that hot seat, hot seat we can start uh, by around 11.40. If you also have questions for Faith, we could start now. Faith, as well, you could turn off, turn on your video. You know that's mandatory. <laughs> and um, we could start the hot seat 
in a few. Mary, I don't know, Mary, if you could help. <laughs> I know you do this very well, Mary. Mary. I'm not sure if Mary can. Hear yes, Anastasia. Oh, there you are. <laughs> I was actually wondering if you can help in the hot seat because um, you really need it very well to engage the people. Okay, it's 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 a bit noisy in my background, but I'll yeah. I'll try. Oh, uh, we have faith uh, to turn on your camera, please. And guys, let's start uh, putting our questions together. And it's high time we start seeing some hands going up. Faith, we are still waiting to see your lovely face. I'm trying. I'm trying to turn on camera, but ah, Faith, Faith, Faith. No, uh, let me join the baby. Okay. Okay. Um, guys, uh, we need to see some hands up, some hands going up as Faith is fixing his camera. Well, should I assume nobody's curious to know anything about Faith because we all know everything. Okay, Daisy, that's really nice. Okay, any more hands? Any more hands? Okay, Baruch, more hands, please. Ah, there you go. Hi, Faith. Hi. Uh, okay, we are still waiting for more hands for us to get started. Um, yeah, okay. We have three hands. Guys, seven more hands. Seven more hands. Seven more hands before we get started. It's going to be real quick. Salam. Well done. Okay, uh, Matilda, okay, any more hands? As you guys are bringing your hands up, I just want to remind Faith. Uh, so it's about how many questions you're able to respond in five minutes. Um, and you're welcome to use the keyword pass if you're not comfortable to respond to any of the questions. Um, and guys, you're welcome to ask anything you'd like uh, to know about faith. So basically, the sky is the limit because he also has a card of of using pass. So ask whatever it is. Okay. Um, all right, guys, two more hands, two more hands for us to get started. I think we are past the time. We were uh, requested to have... Okay. Uh, as more hands are coming up, dear Mark, thanks. Okay, we'll get started. I'll just stop the timer now. Uh, it's 11.42. Okay. Okay, Faith, I'll go first. Okay, what's your perfect first date like? My perfect date? First date. So you're going oh, we, with a, a person for a first date. What would be a perfect first date looking like? No, quiet place. A quiet, like in your room? Just a quiet place, like environment. Okay, a quiet environment. Okay, interesting. Uh, Daisy, do you want to go next? Oh, um, Faith, what was the motivation for your graduate studies? For my uh, graduate studies? Yes. Yeah. Um, to develop my potential. Okay, uh, Biruk. Hi, Faith. Uh, one thing you want to tell us about your country? Um, Rwanda is uh, beautiful and green. Interesting. Okay. Um, 10 Academy team, the host. What's your hidden talent? I don't have a, uh, a hidden talent. Pass. You do not have a hidden talent? 
if I have to answer, I would say um, impersonating someone. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay. Now we need to get a bit of a demo for that. Okay. Um, Salam. What would you do with your first salary when you get the job? What would you do with um, your first salary? Sorry, Salam, I can't hear. What would you do with your first salary? Eat it. What do you mean, eat it? Like, eat the Spend. money? On what? <laughs> on one. Spend on what? Of course you spend the money, but on Shop what? Shopping. Okay, shopping. Interesting. So he's a big shopper. Okay, Matilda? Matilda, do you want to go next? Oh, you texted. All right. Um, so uh, from Matilda, what do you do in your free time? Uh, YouTube. You watch YouTube. Interesting. Okay. Uh, I think there was uh, Rafa as well. What makes you really happy? What makes you a really happy person? Okay. What makes you really happy? um accomplishment the the feeling of accomplishment is is it accomplishment in everything or anything um when tasks are done okay all right dear mark then daisy i think we still have a minute to go okay uh, what's your favorite song my favorite song so uh, this week is uh, uh, good, good morning, uh, Kanye West. Okay. Uh, all right, Daisy, go. Um, who's your favorite artist, music artist? Uh, Wizkid. Wizkid. Interesting. So um, there's one from Melaku. How many people from Batch 5, I mean the trainees, can you... Do you remember by name? <laughs> should, should I call them because um No, you can just say like eighty percent or um seventy percent. Seventy percent, okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh another one from Ten Academy. What is your favorite quote? My favorite quote. Um I don't remember the uh, the person who said it, but uh, it's um, um, don't go in front of me. I may not follow. Don't go behind me. I may not lead. Uh, walk beside me and be my friend. Say that again. I think I missed it. Uh, don't go in uh, front of me. I may not uh, follow. Don't go behind me. I may not uh, lead. Walk beside me and be my friend. Okay. And why is that? Okay. Maybe this is the last question. Why is that your favorite quote? Can you give us some context? Um, I think, I think uh, it resonates with uh, what I think is uh, ideal uh, leadership uh, um, method. So maybe that's why uh, I like it. All right. So you, okay, uh, that makes sense. Anyway, thank you so much. The time is up. I'm sorry. I think, Daisy, you had one more? Or you ha it's the hand from earlier? Oh, sorry, it's the hand from earlier. Okay. Okay, so thank you very much. Uh, well done, guys. Some, um, okay, Ken, to close for us in style. Ken? One favorite, what's one favorite quote from Arun, the tutor, <laughs> you remember? Uh, this is bonus time. Um, that's, that's a tough one. Okay, so um, I'll call it, a, you call it yeah. a pass? 
Pass. All right. Uh, okay, so thank you. Um, <laughs> yeah, thank you, Ten Academy team. Yeah, Ten thank you so much. Deserve a pass. Yeah. So, Faith, you were able to respond to uh, 10, 15 questions. That is well done. So, um, let's hear from you. How was your experience being on a, uh, on a, on a hot seat for today? Um, I think uh, I think it was, it was okay. So because I didn't prepare because there is a, you don't know how you can prepare, but uh, I think I was able to answer most of the questions. Um, my and how do you feel being on the spotlight? Um, I was I was about to say they they probably uh, been uh, nice to me, uh, but uh, it's a it's a great experience. Um, you you get uh, with that short time you get to um, to reflect on uh, things about you. For example, uh, I think it's uh, every so as me my hidden talent. I haven't thought about that like in the long time, but now I'm going maybe to see if I have another hidden talent that I don't know myself. Okay, so you you were right. Good. Yeah, for the first time, people were really nice on somebody on the hot seat. I am telling you, last week, nobody was nice to me. And it's not very fair, probably because Rafa is saying you're a really calm person. Maybe that is the reason they were a little bit... Even Ken himself. Ken is known not to be so nice, but for the first time, he was. Um, yeah, and well done. You did so well. So any feedback from the trainees? Anyone who wants to give Faith feedback on what, how you think um, uh, he he managed the entire spotlight? Anyone who wants to go first? Okay, can, can I see your hand up? Is it from earlier? So nobody has feedback for Faith. Okay, Faith, I'll give you feedback myself. I I think oh. you were Yeah, I, I, I think you were a bit more reserved with some questions. So you were like responding in a way that you know you are not necessarily revealing anything, but you, you don't want to call it a pass. So you, you are being uh, you you are being a bit reserved yeah with with some revealing answers uh, i think you were composed so which was good you were very composed and ready for any question and 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 very calm so i don't know if there's anyone else um yeah daisy you're right he's more like a one-liner so i i could hold on to wait for more expecting that you're going to put some context into some you know um a response but uh, but I, I would say you did well. You did well. Anyway, thank you guys. If there's no one else with um, any more comments, I will um, I will return the ball over to Anastasia. I don't know if you are about to conclude on something, Anastasia. Okay, thank you, Mary, for that. Uh, as always, that was a really good uh, session, especially led by you. So thank you for that, and thank you, Faith, for being on the house, agreeing to be on the house today. So I don't think there's uh, any other major announcement from the team, and uh, I saw Rahmet did say something, so Rahmet again, thanks for that. And um, yes, the academy team, who's that list? Thanks, Anastasia. Uh, so what I can say is that um, it's related to our application for batch six, so, you know, it's it's closing next week by Monday, I guess, uh, that first. But so we want you guys, you can help us distribute or spread the news to your community as as we need more applicants for this occasion. So if you can please do that, it will be very helpful because I, I believe we have already shared you with some information from Mary and uh, we can we can use uh your advantage and you, you know that our future applicants are your sisters and brothers and it's all about expanding the community as 10 academy 
if you know someone interested in your region or your network, please feel free to, to share the information. Okay, thank you for that, Everest. And uh, Everest has said the deadline is 31st March. That is Sunday, not Monday. So make sure to, yeah, take note of that. So did say you have something to add? Hello, Anastasia. Uh, I have a question for Everest, maybe, for the announcement. Uh, which which graduate yeah, yeah. do you prefer for the... <clears throat> for the coming ten academy training. Uh, I mean, uh, is the when graduation 2022 or 2021? 2020 and above, uh, preferably okay. 2021. Okay. 2020 is okay. For example, most of the applicant are, some of them are uh, uh, MSc holder, some of them are BSc holder, so, mm. Do you prefer oh. both or BSc only? Anyone is a uh, welcome to apply. Okay. Whether you have a bachelor's or master's, PhD. No. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you, Felicia, for that question, which has uh, given us a little bit more clarification. So, do we have anyone with anything else to add, or can we wrap up, wrap up here? Okay, silence means everything is great. Okay, so we can just stop the recording. Uh, thank you for showing up for the last one hour. And uh, have a great day. Don't forget the tutorial. And uh, see you another time. Cheers. Bye.